Queuing up for Scooting Air in, which is like the Scooting Airs come check your car. It's to make sure that nothing can go wrong and that we built the car to a high enough standard. Scrutineering is really about safety, trying to make sure the car is safe to perform, making sure everybody understands how the car works and that it's made in a safe way, both electrically and mechanically. It needs to be done just to make sure the car is uh, safe, really, just to make sure everything's running properly so nothing goes wrong during the race. So we're just about to do a full MOT on this car. So the full MOT is a uh, full check that we do at the start of every season. Um, just to make sure the car is all safe and it's been made to, uh, to our standards and regulations. The car is being checked for any kind of faults or anything that we've kind of not done properly. We're looking at checking the brakes, uh, steering as well. Cars need to be very good at steering. Uh, the speeds have increased over the years, so it's very important that brakes and steering are, are very hot. Driver, you want to squeeze the brakes on as hard as you can. And just a one hand on the roll bar and a very firm push. And we're just trying to see if we can get the car moving. That's nice and solid on this car, so we'll, that's all fine there. They like check that the seat belts can be tightened all of the way. They check that the driver's head is like at the right angle to the front of the seat so they can like see everything. We are checking the roll bar to make sure it's far enough above the driver's head to be safe. So if we get our, our nice stick onto the top of the roll bar and we're checking this height in here between the roll bar and making sure that's greater than 50 millimetres. They're going to search the car, check it's safe. You can see here we've got bodywork all the way to the back of the car, just making sure that the bodywork is reaching is high enough up the, up the driver that they're fully inside the car, and that's fine. Looking down into the car now, um, we can see that both batteries are in, this, in a metal tray with this, with this red bar over the top here, pinned at both ends, and the batteries aren't strapped together. Electrically, of course, cars need to be very safe. The wires are going to be the right size, the trip's got to be the right size, and there are all the connections have got to be tight. Now we're looking just to make sure the harness anchor points are strong and secure, so we've got a nice big bolt onto the chassis there, give it a good pull, check to see if it's, if it's tight or not, and then looking back to the shoulders again. A nice big bolt on, on either side. Just having a feel of the tyres, making sure that there's actually plenty of tread on there, we're not wearing through anywhere. We do offer advice, things that can be improved. Certainly cars have got faster, they've made of different materials, and we've got to be very careful that we understand how the cars are made so that they are continually safe.